Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. My name is... Wait, that's way too cliche. Why not even write that in the script? Back that up. Hi, my name's Jeremiah Paparazzo. I'm a student, a teacher, a learner, and a leader. And this is the community school. What? Uh, there we go. What is the community school? That's a very common question. The community school is unlike any high school experience you've ever seen or heard of before. It's what you make it. It's gonna be nothing like anyone else's. While most schools you may know of busy themselves going from class to class doing several assignments, we're a project-based learning high school. We do projects to learn. We take on authentic issues and, and real-world problems. And we have a lot of control over what we learn and how we learn it. Our big motto here is, oh, pff, gosh, dang it. Come on, Come on man, own, own your, your learning. learning. Yeah. Own your learning because we're cool like that. We personalize our learning to prepare ourselves for life after high school. We don't busy ourselves reading facts off a list just to memorize them. We learn something because we know we're going to use it in the future. We push ourselves to be better. If we fail, we have a family of people to fall back on. We're like a big happy family. We even call our teachers by their first name. Oh hey Sarah, how's it going? What's up? Oh you know, just keeping it real. They listen to and respect us as individuals. They encourage us to advance in our learning and pursue our passions in what is called independent projects. Is it easy? No, but it's worth it. For a very small example of what we can do here for independent projects, I'm making this video. Are you into journalism? Chloe is the head of our completely student-run school newspaper. Carlin directed the Broadway musical 13. It was completely student-driven. Okay, repeat after me. Ah! Ah! Cut! Cut! You can do better than that! Really? Come on! Bro! Dude! Bro! Neva's independent project was planning a trip to Portland where she'll be doing an internship all summer for Autodesk. I'm out. We are the community school, so we do interact with the community. Riley here is doing an internship for Scraps. Look at all these chickens! Looking for college and career prep? Spencer here is working with real dentists to find out how they got where they are. Anthony teaches a computer class and is the head of the student-led tech support team. Griffin enjoys wire wrapping, so he decided to turn into a small business and he still enjoys doing what he loves. Brandon's project is to raise awareness of his disability. Get out of here, Joey, I'm working! Want to do something more fun? Not to say that any of these projects aren't fun, but Monique and Delaney are working on a lip dub video. A five, six, seven, eight! Woo! That was good! That was good! That was good. Claire's independent project? She's making an art night here at TCS. Our counselor's door is always open, so if you have anything we need to talk to her about or any problems that come up, we can bring them to her. Hi, Debbie. Hi, everybody. Come see me. In the den, all of our teachers have their desks in the same room so that they can collaborate together. Here at the community school, we're taught once again to own our learning. We make classes based on interests that we want to pursue. We call these classes wellnesses. They're like electives, but normally you wouldn't get these classes at normal schools. 
In a traditional high school setting, electives change once every semester, whereas these classes change often so that you can pursue many interests throughout the year. For instance, we got STEM Lab, Drama, African Drumming, Math Lab, Pals, Drawing, Greenhouse, Flash Fiction. We have tons of other electives on top of that. Mixed media, yearbook, newspaper, we have a feminist club, we have a Socratic seminar club. While the community school is a great place for alternative learning, it is also very rigorous. You need to be very independent and self-motivated. On top of that, our students are not only graded on if they got the correct answer or not, we're also graded on what's called agency, the habits of heart, mind, and health. For this grade, we need to be on time, we need to meet deadlines, we need to be willing and to learn and be enthusiastic in our learning, and an overall commitment to the project. Yeah, we got lots of cool things to do here at the community school, and we have lots of cool aspects about us. But I think the coolest part about us is that we are a community. We are the community school. We are very close to one another, much like much like a family, really. But of all the things we have, we are missing one thing. You. Oh hey, I didn't see you there. My name is Jeremiah. Thank you for watching my video. This video was my independent project for school. If you noticed in the video, there was a lot of really dumb comedy. <sighs> you see, when I was preparing to make this video, I was actually watching a lot of other videos to prepare for this one. Watching a lot of uh, other promotional videos to see what I liked and didn't like about them. What you saw in this video was me making fun of all those promotional videos. Where I basically did everything that I disliked and then more. Did lots of really dumb special effects, used the cliche of, oh hey, I didn't see you there. This is a very small step in a very much larger project. I plan on one day becoming a director and filmmaker professionally. My next steps toward this are making a movie next year, and after that I plan on making a web series that I've been planning since I was 10 years old. I'd like to thank you again for watching this video. I'd also like to thank you for your time and your support. If you like this video, please click the like button down below. If you want to see more content from Gamer Pack Films in the future, please hit the subscribe button down below. If you want to see some of our previous films, in the next segment of this video, you'll see a couple annotations to our past two productions. You can click those. Also, please go like our Facebook page. There is a link down below in the description. And thank you once again for the view, and thank you for your time.